excellent, excellent, excellent comic, Mark. Excellent comic. Yes. Uh, the fact that he made these, let me see, obtuse. <laughs> obt- they wanted the Mets to make some obtuse considerations to augment his contract. Mm-hmm. Um, you know what? I don't think he was the first player to ever ask for those sort of things, but they just put it out there to to, to, to attack him. You know, who knows what these players be asking for in their contracts when they believe, like, yeah, I'm the best player, this is what I want, and if you want me to sign here, this is what you're going to give me. No, you know, I, I, was saying that, I was saying that that is when things started going bad for him, right. when, 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 when all that stuff came Jeter, out. The stuff he said about Derrick Jeter was true. <laughs> At the time, the stuff he said was true, and there's nothing wrong with that. But because it was no, Derek I didn't Jeter, find anything wrong with his comments. It's right, the but other you know, people who took and ran with that. But right, Derek yes, Jeter, yes, yes, me and Derek yes, Jeter, yes, took back. took high, took very high offense to that. Yeah, because Derek and Jeter ran big. with that. He's a who? Yes, Mac, I agree with you. How many shortstops in the American League were considered in a conversation to be the who were touted to be the best shortstop in the American League during the time yeah. of uh, but Kevin, Peter, Avard, had yeah, no more. Tara, you had mm-hmm. Ian, there were, uh, th- there were a couple of others, a couple of other young ones who fell off the, yeah. who, you know, who fell off after a while. Yeah, but, but Kevin, mean, there was, there, why, why do you call A-Rod, I mean, why do you call Derek Jeter a bitch? Because. For getting mad at can't. him. You can't say nothing about Derek Jeter. Derek Jeter is like the best player to ever do it. Everything he does is right. Every don't you ever slander Derek Jeter. Who but the, no, no. Who the fuck? But that's that's between him and A Rod. Right. So he should have just said, "Yo, I appreciate how you came at me." And they was best friends. For him to take that as but, a well, personal. Derek Jeter never said anything. He never said anything back about right, but you could He tell. just cut him off. Right, and that's a bitch move. How Kevin. is that? Kevin. That's How like is you that? saying, that's Kevin. like saying, yo, you say your girl can't cook, so she decides. I, 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 I have to, I, I have to stop all of this. All right, <laughs> I, I have to stop on this. Women don't lie. When women want to out a brother out. What do they do, Kevin? They air your laundry out for weeks. <laughs> what did Madonna and what's the girl? The, the what's the girl? Carmen. Um, the girl yeah. from Mask. Carmen Diaz. What did they both say about A. Rod? They left him within months because. Well, I'm not going to say why. But things are telling. When women say you can't win, wait, wait a minute. Madonna was linked with A Rod. Carmen Diaz was linked with A Rod. When women say you cannot perform because of whatever reason, that's that's that's. But that's news. That's if you care about that. What does that have to do with his ability to play baseball? I don't give a f if about his your if the press is going after you for P E D and if the press has any kind any kind whatever percentage of scientific data which says the lack of Sexual performance can be linked with PEDs. With the ingestion of PEDs, they're going to go after it. Look at what Barry Bonds' girlfriend did with him. Okay, so where, where were you going, um, Mr. Bush, with with with, right. with that angle? What I'm saying is, <laughs> in, in terms of A Rod, in, in terms of A Rod, the press look, the press used that as a field day. To fuel their uh, witch hunt, 
must well, miss A-Rod. all that coverage. Yes, I agree with that. I see. Yes, I firmly agree with that. The press. All right, but so what? Be- he took steroids. So what? Big deal. I'm tired of people acting like baseball was tarnished. You know, all the more reason why I you say think- keep Kevin, Mac, Rodney. This is why yes. I have always been steadfast in saying. Keep your mouth shut. Concentrate on baseball. Let your performance speak for you. The fans will forget it. No, the fans mm-hmm. never gonna forget it. They never gonna. Yes, they have. They they up. forgot about Ryan Braun. He did some. Yes, he did yes, something yes, even yes, more. Yeah, more yeah, more he did worse, than a yeah, That's what I'm saying. He did worse than a rod. But if he, he got was a man, in the New York man market, lost his job because of because of Ryan Braun. And we know how I felt about him. He would, he would be vilified, too. Case we so we picked on A-Rod because you could kind of get A-Rod to say something stupid. A-Rod is that guy that you give a couple of drinks to and just watch him annihilate himself. And people would Kevin, do that. Too. Kevin, 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 what did you just say? Because you can do what to get, you, you can get A-Rod to do what? Yeah, he does it to himself, but still. No, 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 no. Say what you say. <laughs> what? He annihilates himself. <laughs> No, 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 no. That's not what you said. That's not what you said. That's what I said. No, you said, and I quote, you can get A-Rod to say something stupid. Right. There you go. Say That's it again. Because, so, but what does that have to do with how he plays? This is what I'm saying. You. So the man can say whatever he wants. Look what happened to Dennis Rodman. Dennis Rodman said a bunch say, of outlandish stuff. You just put it out out there. You just put it out there. You said you can get the you can get A Y to say something stupid and the press will run with it. End of story. That's yeah, it. but we acting like the New York press is the word of God. You know, these dudes they they get in their papers and they get on their little blogs and they just talk tons of crap. And most of these guys haven't played no games. These guys are not not athletes like Mike Lupica and all these dudes on ESPN radio and ESPN. You think I'm vouching for Mike Lupica? About. I, I, no, no, I can't saying. stand him. Right. <laughs> no shit. Oh, excuse me. And New York no crap, Sherlock. No crap, right. Sherlock. Kevin, but Kevin, like, that's the best thing you've said. You know, yes. Yes, Kevin, I agree with you 100%. I agree with you 100%. New York media is regarded as one of the best media within the world. Especially in overrated. the States. I disagree. <laughs> oh, I disagree. You're entitled There's, to your you know, opinion, though. They overrated, though. Maybe. I wouldn't, I wouldn't yeah, say overrated. They're, they're, opi- they're opinionated, opinionated and usually wrong on, right. on much of their observations on certain people. Right. How are you going to so they things. talk about A Rod? They say, okay, A Rod's turning 40. Reasonably, what does he have left? If you watch Derek Jeter play last year, what did he have left? Nothing. But because he's the All legend. All the more reason as water to my building blocks for A Rod to keep his mouth quiet. Right, but what I'm saying is, right, at this this particular moment, he's not saying anything that you could really run with and say, oh, look what he's doing. He's basically probably saying... You you posted the ESPN article. I read it. Right, I read that. Yes, yes, yes. And that's up to you. That's up to the reader if they want to believe what he said in it. You know, I thought it was a a, That was a a bad look. It was a bad look. Why is that a bad look? Why is that a bad look? All through that article, he he's he's a liar. He lies. Uh. That's what he does. He says things so that who's you can to give say that him. he's a liar? Who cares? Who cares? He what lied. He lied multiple times. What does it matter to us? Who cares? All these athletes lie. Oh, they do. What? So why are we focusing on him? 
because this dude he puts the focus on he puts the focus on him. Just like Kevin first of all, say, in that like, ESPN like article, Kevin, there was no Kevin, direct quote. Kevin, Kevin my brother, A-Rod. it's like Cat Williams say. I'm giving B A N. That's what B A N do. Listen, um, reading the article. <laughs> Let me know he's even more of a narcissist than I thought he was. And he, well, he, he he wants he wants to please everybody, but at the same time he has an air of arrogance. I mean, to be honest, to do what these guys do, you kinda gotta be a narcissist and you kinda gotta be arrogant. Well, there are a lot of arrogant people. What? What? Right. But you can't I'm be arrogant. arrogant. <laughs> you can't be arrogant and then sit there and want sympathy. There you, Kevin. Um, um, I'm sorry, Max and Slevin. That is that is the difference. I mean, at the end of the day, everybody want to focus a little bit too hard on what the hell he's doing away from the diamond. You know, and like look at the Yankees. How dare the Yankees treat him like this? But they're about to retire Andy Pettit's number. That is like the biggest. Well, and, and Andy Pettit, Andy Pettit went about his business. It quietly. doesn't matter. Andy Pettit was lying. Kevin, you know what? I will applaud, no, 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 no. Kevin, I will Pettit, applaud you for that comment. He, he may have like, been oh, lying, but he did it smartly. No, he didn't do it smartly. He just had the respect yes, of the media. Did. No, he yes, didn't. He, he did, did the same thing A-Rod did. But you know what? We took the Andy Pettis set and said, you know what? Andy Pettis is a good guy. We believe him. Let's leave him alone. Now, with A-Rod, he could there get up there and go. say, you know, that's I was what, doing... That's what... Well, well, then why did you say he did it smartly? I didn't say he did I it said smartly. That. I said he did I the same thing sorry. that A-Rod did. Yes, he did. He, back. Sat up he there didn't do the same thing press, A-Rod did. He sat up there with a press conference. And he said, oh, I did this, I did that, I never meant to cheat the game, da 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 a whole bunch of BS. But we said, you know what, Andy's a good guy. We believe him. You know what? We and it went away, right? His, his yeah, team story not, went away, right? It's exactly. never going to go away with A-Rod because well, he's not... the biggest name in the sport. He makes the most money. And we want to see people like him fall. Exactly, Kevin. So that's not exactly. his fault. Kevin. Whoa, whoa. That's but not, hold A-Rod on, hold made on. the most money. Oh. Andy hold on a Pettit. second. Is that his fault? Andy. Oh, hold, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Andy Pettit was a devout Christian. I don't he care. Had family he was value. lying. That's your opinion. Catholic priests sodomized That's your their opinion. Boys. And they priests. That's your opinion. Men of God. That's, Kevin, that's your opinion. Man, Have you seen it? You don't, know if, you don't know if it's true. And you don't know if anything a says is true. <laughs> there you go. See how that works? Therefore, See how that therefore, works? we don't therefore, know what for or A Rod has don't to know do is shut <laughs> his mouth. I will say this like. again. What A Rod needs to do is shut his mouth and let his performance speak for no, itself. No, but my thing is that A Rod is not talking. The I little agree stuff with that you. he's saying. So why are you saying what I'm that? going to say? What I'm going to say is going. What I'm going to say now, you know, substantiates what you're saying. Yes. His cousin's wife came out and came out with a statement. There was some stuff between him and Roger Clemens. Yes, true. I, you know, I get that. I get that. In a Rod's defense, he has not failed a drug test, a random drug test. I have been a staunch supporter of that. This is why I take the stand as wanting him to come back as good as he can be. This is why I also say he needs to shut his mouth before you came on. I said, listen, I wish I, 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 wish I was his agent and carrying duct tape. I'd walk him past the fans, sign your autographs, sign your autographs, so, sign your so autographs Kevin, for two, three hours. Writing, writing the letter was a bad move. Why well, was writing the letter a bad move? <laughs> Nobody believes him. The, the media it had a field matter, day with him. But he felt like he had to do that. So that, if you don't believe him, that's his, his problem. So shut. what is he supposed to do? You know what? Had he came back and said nothing, they're going to be like, yo, look at this guy. He thinks, you know, 
we don't, you know, he could just do this and we don't and not say nothing. Either way, it's damned if you do, damned if you don't. And I'm going to tell you how much of a wish hut people was hating on A-Rod. Because in 2006, or whenever that was, when after Jose Canseco said, hey, you know, all these guys are on steroids, what did baseball do? Baseball said, you know what, we have to investigate. So what they did was they gave a test, or they, they tested some players, and 104 people popped. And it was supposed to be confidential. That information was supposed to never be made public. And they told the dudes who failed, like, yo, you know, um, you failed. But nobody was ever supposed to know. And then whose was the first name leaked from that list? Alex Rodriguez. There's other people on that list, but they leaked A-Rod's name. Why? Because he's the biggest name in the sport, and he makes the most money, and a lot of people would love to see him humble. When people are doing great, they love to see you fall. So they leaked his name. Especially when you're arrogant. (laughs) I mean, why shouldn't he be arrogant? He's the best at what he does. Kevin, I agree with your philosophy to a point. I agree with your philosophy to a point. That's why I say again, if I was A-Rod's agent, if I was part of his crew, I would say, man, just shut up and play baseball. And I'm sure that's what he's trying to do. But when they keep sticking the microphones in his face, I mean, he's doing well now. He's, he's you know, he's deflected some, some questions and whatnot. But, like, yo, get off the man's jock. Everybody's talking about him. Like, yo, and the Yankees are doing him dirty. Well, that's because the you Yankees know, don't want to pay him that money. It, but you have to. So cut him. Cut him and pay up the but money. The- Nope, because that would look bad. That that would look, look bad, look bad yes. for the Yankees. That would look bad, Yankees yes. are yes. a corporation. So if he hit 240 or 230 like Derek Jeter was doing, and then you cut him? Nah, I'm not with that. Nope. Uh, I'm not with that. That's BS. <laughs> All right, so such a, such a polarizing individual, Mr. Yeah. Alexander is. And, got two and, guys... Debating hard on three guys, three guys. Excuse me, three guys. Pardon me. That's right. That's why I said let me Um, be silent. Oh, I'm gonna let you close it out. I'm gonna let you close it out so we can let me close it out. Yeah. Well, you know what? There's not not really close out. You understand? There's not really close out (laughs) and whatnot. (laughs) See, honestly, you guys are pretty much uh, taking it, dominating. I I just, I just lean and cut and listen. I love a great debate. 